Working in Los Altos after a construction company measured once and cut twice. Carpet short of the new cabinet, so I'll hide the seam along the shadow line. I use the cutoff from the remodel to prep my fill piece. Because of the low height, I can't use my induction iron. So back to basics with the OG hot melt. Any lower, and this wouldn't have worked. And I'd have to pull back more of the carpet, folded it, and seamed it up, then stretched it back. Now comes the hardest part of this method, removing the 300 degree iron without burning myself or the carpet pile. Push down, push it back, and then up. Success. I bump the carpet onto the tacks and tuck under the trim. Now to do the same process on this second cabinet, and while wrapping up, I'm reminded an ounce of prevention is worth a pound of cure. So measure twice and cut once, contractors. You and your clients will be glad you did, but if you don't, I got you loads of carpet cure.